we're in the Motor City. This is an industrialized space. Um, people don't always think that things can grow here, but clearly <laughs> you can. Grown in Detroit is made up of people who are part of the Garden Resource Program. Growers who have a little bit of an entrepreneurial spirit and they want to be able to sell their produce. It's already a lot to be able to be a farmer in general. It's difficult. Growers really just focus on being able to produce the best produce possible. Um, and then we take care of the rest. It's being grown within the city. It's being uh, consumed and purchased by people in the city. And through our program, growers receive 100% of the profits. Through Keep Growing Detroit, we really want to cultivate a food sovereign city. What does that mean, right? Like, we want to just make sure that Detroiters have access to fresh fruits and vegetables, whether they're able to grow it themselves or they have access to the markets where it is being grown. People have that innate need to grow food. It's something that's been in our history forever. And so, to be able to practice that, you know, no matter where you are, especially in an urban setting, it's something that's going to really reconnect people back to the land, back to the soil. Through the garden research program, through Grown in Detroit, like we're reigniting that connection for people. Whether it's uh, being able to actually put their hands in the ground and like grow that produce, or like reconnecting with some kind of fruit or vegetable that they hadn't seen since like they were kids. <laughs> oh my god. There's some really gorgeous produce that hits that table every week. Sustainably grown, locally grown produce isn't just for people who have a lot of money. And it doesn't have to feel like something that is not for us because it is. It's right here. <laughs>